First question, do you have any hidden talents? Watch my eyes. Don't even know how I discovered that? You could probably do it too, I don't know. Try it at home, don't do it too long though, your eyes will get stuck. All right, have you ever seriously considered quitting social media? No, I have not. I can honestly say I have it because I knew deep down inside, if I stayed consistent within the same niche, one day it'll work out. And that's what I did. Never give up. Uh, if you could find out one thing about your future, what would it be? I think it would be cool to see like, I don't know, five, 10 years into your future. But then again, you might, want, might not want to see it. It'd be interesting to know, I think. Huh, maybe not, I don't know. 10 years into my future, what would it look like? Uh, if you could have your dream vacation, where would you go and what would you do? I would go to uh, the Great Barrier Reef to snorkel because I love the ocean. It's a beautiful but yet intimidating place and I like to snorkel. Uh, so I think uh, snorkeling over uh, the Great Barrier Reef would be really cool. Uh, if you can meet any three people dead or alive, who would you want to meet? Uh, I've always been really interested in history so I think it would be really neat to like, um, let's say, have like an interview with somebody from 1900, 1800, and 1700. And then like listen to them talk to each other and compare lifestyles. That would be pretty interesting. If you could take control of anyone's Instagram for one day, uh, who would it be and why? Who would it be? Whoever has the most followers on Instagram and why? Because that's, I think the most followers is like 450 million, which is an astronomical amount of people. If you had to eat one meal for the rest of your life, what would you choose? Sushi. I like sushi. But I pick like, I, I pick like the, the whole category of sushi because it comes in so many different variations. If you were stranded on an island and could only take three objects, what would you, what would they be? Three objects of any kind. I pick a boat, then one, two full tanks of gas. That's three objects. I won't be stranded anymore. A boat, two full tanks of gas. <laughs> what advice would you give to your past self? Concentrate on the things that matter in the long run. All the little simple, oh, not simple, all the little miscellaneous things that you worry about all day long. Kick rocks. Focus on the stuff that matters in the long run. What advice would you give somebody who wants to be a social media creator? Pick a niche that means something to you, that you love. Start posting and be consistent. And don't give up, no matter what. That's what somebody said to me. That's the best advice I was given, and I think it helped a lot. What are your favorite movies of all time? I love The Grinch. How the Grinch Stole Christmas, Jim Carrey version. Uh, let's see what else. I like war movies as well. Uh, I used to be in the military back in my younger 20s, so I might be where the love of war movies came from. Uh, Save It Private Ryan, Red Tails, Flyboys, uh, stuff like that. What's one of your most embarrassing moments? I think I can speak for almost everybody when I say some of the most embarrassing moments is when is when you like fall down in public, especially when you got when you like got your hands full or something, and you fall down, you like make a huge scene, crash over stuff, and everybody just stops and watches you. And then some people are like this, some people are like laughing. That's pretty embarrassing. What is something most people that follow you don't know about you? I have chronic asthma. Yes, I know. I was born with asthma, really bad. Uh, I had to take a steroid called Trilogy every day. It's not bad, I mean, I deal with it. What is your biggest pet peeve? I don't know why, I don't know why, but I hate the sound of high heels, like walking down a hard wood floor or something. I hate the sound of high heels, and I don't know why. Or the sound of someone digging in a purse, when you look and like hear all the things like I hate that sound, oh my gosh. I don't know why. What is your favorite birthday me uh, memory for the last question? Uh, favorite birthday memory. Me and my brother are five years apart exactly. He is, I'm 31, he is 20, what is he, 26? 26, 26, 26. Yeah, he's 26. Uh, both of our birthdays are on August 19th. He was born 96, I was born 91. Uh, I used to hate this as a kid because we would celebrate our birthdays on the same day, so we both get presents. 
And so it, it, the day wouldn't be like about specifically me or him. I'd have to share the day with him. But as I got older, I really learned to appreciate it because it brought more people together. And uh, now like, like uh, all of our family, I don't know, it's come together to celebrate now his birthday. It's pretty cool now, it's very special. It's extremely rare. And uh, so I really learned to appreciate that. I think that was, yes, that was the last question. I hope you enjoyed that Q&A. I hope you learned a lot about me. And uh, I enjoyed it. That was fun. Just remember, Deal Family loves you. Jesus loves you. Also, follow us on all social medias. We have Facebook, TikTok, YouTube, Instagram. It's all the same. Deal underscore family. Y'all have a blessed day. We love you.